This tutorial will show how to print from an iOS device, such as an iPhone or an iPad, to a Brother HL2170W printer using a Raspberry Pi print server. This tutorial assumes you have a Raspberry Pi up and running and you're able to open a shell on your Pi. The first thing we want to do is install CUPS. CUPS stands for Common Unix Print System. It acts as a relay that understands both incoming print requests from your iOS device and how to convert them into print jobs on your printer. It's a translator that allows your iOS device to talk to your printer. Edit the CUPS configuration file to allow any computer on your local network to access the admin panel. CUPS uses a browser-based admin panel, similar to how you administer your wireless router. First, comment out listen on localhost 631 and add port 631. Next, add allow at local to the slash slash admin and slash admin conf location paths. Now restart the CUPS service to pick up the new configuration changes. Finally, we need to add the user pi to the LP admin group to allow us to use this login to administer the printers. Now we'll go ahead and navigate to the CUPS admin panel to add a printer to CUPS. So I'm gonna to go to adding printers add printer. It's going to tell me that it wants to use HTTPS to access the admin panel. It'll warn you about your certificate being invalid. Don't worry about it. Just proceed as planned. Um, add a printer. Uh, don't choose one of these. Go straight for the LPD, LPR, host, or printer. Didn't have luck with the other ones. Um, here you'll need to know the IP number of your printer and uh, slash Q afterwards. I'm using the brother HL2170W. Um, so go ahead and put in a description. Some more description. Mine is in the basement. I'm gonna share it. Um, here the specific driver won't be available uh, for the 2170, but uh, this driver for all intents and purposes uh, works with the printer. Keep the default options. And now go ahead and do a quick test page to make sure everything went okay. Printing, 48%. And I can hear the printer kicking off in the basement. So it looks good. Now the final step is to install Avahi Discover, which will allow AirPrint on your iOS device to discover your printer. And for good measure, I restarted the Avahi daemon after the initial install because it didn't start working right away. Not sure if this is really necessary. Your iOS device should now register your newly added CUPS printer. So, there it is. And go ahead and give it a print. Alright, hope you were able to follow along and um, good luck with all your print jobs.